Hey guys, it's Jeff. Today we're at the Frederickstead Pier on the west end of St. Croix in the U.S. Virgin Islands. This dive site is absolutely fantastic. It's definitely a local favorite and uh, you can dive here a million times and almost never see the same thing twice. It really, really is an impressive dive site. So uh, we've got our full face mask equipment and our underwater communication stuff with us today. So we're going to be narrating this dive both above and below the surface. And we're going to be doing it during the day and we're coming back for a night dive. So uh, stick with us through the end of the video. And if you like what you see, make sure to subscribe. So getting to the pier is easy. Just take Centerline Road straight down into Frederickstead. You can't miss the pier. It's 1,500 feet long and heads straight out into the ocean. Parking, however, is a little bit of a challenge. You can't park on the pier any longer, so you gotta find parking somewhere in town. The real challenge comes with your gear though. So you can drop off your gear at the gate, Sherpa it down to the entry at the pier on the north side, or you can take your gear with you wherever you park, put it together there, and carry it down with you as well. Let's talk about the dive site a little bit. The pier is 1,500 feet long. It's about a third of a mile. The average depth is 25, 30 feet. You can, at the extreme end of the pier, get down to about 90 or 100 feet. But the typical dive here is about 25, 30 feet. On a good tank of air, you can get about an hour, or if you're really conservative, a little bit longer. <clears throat> so let's take a look at this side from the air, and then we're gonna get our gear together. Up on the surface on a concrete platform. 
But underwater, they are covered in soft corals and teeming with fish. So to finish our dive here at the pier, we just follow these rocks back to the beach and get on out. We're going to do that now, but we're coming back for a night dive. We're going to wait for the sun to go down and then go grab some new tanks and head out for a night dive. So you may be wondering, where can I get tanks? Well, here it's really easy. There's actually four dive shops located just in front of the pier. There's St. Croix Ultimate Blue Water Adventures. Next door, there's Cane Bay Dive Shop. And around the corner, there's Neptune Scuba Diving. And just around from that, in the back of the street, is Adventures in Diving STX. All are great shops. Definitely check out our website for our preferences. So the one time you can't dive at the pier is when there's a cruise ship in port. However, you can jump on one of the dive boats and head out with them. You can explore the reef around the pier or the area near and in front of the pier. All right, the sun's getting low in the sky and we're gonna head back on over and gear gear together and head on back in for a night dive. Night dives at the pier are absolutely fantastic. Our colors just really come out with our lights and there's so much sea life to see from small things like little crabs and shrimp to much larger sea life like turtles and octopus and squid. So uh, hang with us, let's get back in. Okay, 
we're back at the mooring dolphin. These things are so cool. There's often stingray, under here squid just schooling around. Generally, lots of sea life and fish all up and down the columns. Pretty awesome dive yesterday at the pier. Absolutely. Yeah, it's always a, always a great spot. Uh, Evan, what was your favorite part of the day? My favorite part of the pier are the night dives because of the frequent sightings of octopus and seahorses. And it's just overall really cool. And you can dive the site multiple times and see different stuff every single time. Yeah, absolutely. It's really a, really a local favorite site and it, the diversity there is absolutely amazing. What, what, about, what about your thoughts? I don't know, it's hard to choose whether a day dive or a night dive is better just because of the different um, parts of the pier that you can spend so much time just exploring. Uh, octopus in crevices, seahorse on the pilings, um, frogfish hiding. Yeah. Pretty interesting. It's all kinds of stuff. There's some batfish in the sand, the little uh, garden eels down there. So there's so much diversity here. My favorite is at night. I really enjoy getting in at night and seeing the colors pop in the lights. But uh, absolutely, absolutely fantastic dive site here at the Frederick Slick Pier. So uh, if you guys like what you saw, make sure to subscribe and uh, join us for the next one.